Hello aspirants, welcome back to my channel. Today in this video we will talk about the uh, prehistoric age, its culture, its various stages. Before we look in further in its season, uh, first um, we will look into uh, the evolution of humans in succinct. So how human evolve? human evolution basically homo habilis then homo erectus This were the evolution of humans. So first it Homo habilis. This walk on hands. These were the species which walk on their hands. And during this time, brain start evolve. Brain gets started. Brain started developing. So the brain started developing. brain started uh, developing okay and this homo erectus erectus means erected man erected man walk through legs so so they can travel long travel so it can travel long and here brain brain get develops um, as compared to uh, the first one then homo sapiens homo sapiens this is the wise wise man and these are these homo sapiens this is the, where the brain developed this is regarded as wise man and from this our species has been evolved okay our species our species has been evolved from homo sapiens into a full-fledged man into a full-fledged modern man okay so this were the uh, brief about the human evolution from homo habilis to homo sapiens into full-fledged modern man uh, coming back to the topic prehistoric age is the age before the invention of writing before the invention of writing is known as prehistoric age and based on tools and technique it is based on tools and technique it has been divided into Paleolithic, Mesolithic, Neolithic. Okay. So Paleo means old. Paleo means old, and Lithic means stone. Okay. Paleolithic is all further divided into three parts. It is lower, middle, and upper. Okay. And the men were food food gatherers. Man were food gatherers and hunters. Okay. And the man also, the man of Mesolithic age also hunters, hunters and herders. And the man of Neolithic age were food, were the food producer. Okay, Paleolithic lower lower age. So uh, lower Paleolithic people use chopping tools. Chopping tools like cleavers and hand excess. Uh, middle use plague, plague tools. This 
this also this middle age middle paleolithic is also known as flake culture due to the use of flake tools this learned to control learn to control fire learn to control fire in bladed borins bone tools is in upper paleolithic homo sapiens homo sapiens evolved geographical distribution of paleolithic age Kashmir Valley, Suhan Valley, Milan Valley. So people of this Paleolithic age are nomadic life. Led a nomadic life. Okay. So this were the uh, about the this were the points about the Paleolithic. Low, uh, Paleolithics were further divided subdivided into three categories: lower, middle, and upper. Upper lower middle and upper categories okay so in lower they uh, lower they use chopping tools like levers and hand axes in mid middle paleolithic age they used uh, tools made out of flake and this uh, middle paleolithic age is also regarded as flake culture learn to control fire learn to control fire flake culture so in the upper paleolithic uh, culture people use tools of made out mix made out of bones burins okay and a geographical uh, distribution the people has um, its geographical distribution is in belan valley sohan valley Jam, uh, kashmir valley peoples were uh, uh, basically nomads and hunters so they led a nomadic life so mesolithic this is a transition phase this is a transition phase between the pre uh, paleolithic and the neolithic age okay Mesolithic age uh, temperature get rises and temperature get rises and climate became warm uh, in in this period a melting of ice occurred and pe people of this mesolithic mesolithic age uh, learn how uh, learn fishing and domestication of some animals so people learned fishing and domestication domestication of some domestication of some animals okay famous site is adamgar adamgar and Magor, this is is in Rajasthan, and Adamgar is in Gar is in U M P, and uh, rock painting at Bimbetka. Rock painting at Bimbetka. This is in M P. Age Neolithic is no new stone age. This coined by. John Lubbock. So Neolithic is a new stone age. Uh, this new stone age termed by John Lubbock and started full fledged of domestication of animals used polished tools. And here man led man led to began a settled life and element of village settled life with the age of uh, started cultivation of crops cultivation of crops and full-fledged and full-fledged domestication domestication of animals settled settled life Settled life and to began to lead a settled life. So, as they uh, were started cultivating crops, so uh, th their need, uh, so there, uh, there is a new evolution of poetry for the for the 
storation of grains and for and to cook them so pottery, new pottery evolved during this period will also evolve during this period it is almost spread all over the indian the indian subcontinent some important sites there are some important sites which are uh, which are uh, really important for the exam point of view so first one is mehargarh evidence of house see mehargarh is the site where evidence of house and evidence of cultivation of crops has been found so evidence of house and evidence of cultivation of crops like wheat wheat barley and cotton johom is in kashmir valley where dwelling pits were evidence of dwelling pits found domestic um, um, uh, buried of a uh, buried of domesticated dog with his master has been found uh, bone or uh, bone tools has been um, evidence of evidence of dwelling pits evidence of dwelling pits so uh buried of what buried of a uh, domesticated dog with his master with his master okay then bone tools evidence of bone tools have been found in gafral it is in verge home third point is belan valley belan valley number 4 and valley in up cherand in bihar cherand in bihar belan valley in up gafral is the place uh, where bo where both uh, animal husbandry and cultivation of plants have been uh, evidenced as far as the arts of prehistoric arts so prehistoric are concerned so prehistoric art there is one major site that is bimbetka cave of mp rock paintings of rock paintings of bimbetka Uh, as far as the arts or prehistoric cultures are concerned um, uh, its major site is one or one prominent site is rock, rock painting of bimbetka cave M, in mp uh, where the paintings has been found where the, the sub the subjects were fishing hunting food gathering and animals also dis, di, uh, depicted and some social issues has also been depicted hunting fishing food gathering hunting okay hunting fishing and food gathering were the subjects this were, this paints has been uh, found number 2 um, animals has been depicted animals has been depicted that is b square mn b square mn this boar boar buffalo monkey and nilgai so these animals were also has been depicted no snakes has been depicted so also some social social events has been depicted like child birth like child birth child rearing burial ceremony burial ceremony so this were the uh, arts of the prehistoric culture so uh, so we have seen how uh, human evolved how human evolved from homo habilis 
to homo sapiens sapiens from to uh, modern full fledged modern man after that we have seen how uh, prehistoric has been divided into uh, divided based on tools and technique used by the peoples that is um, the divisions were as follows pre uh, paleolithic uh, mesolithic and uh, neolithic paleo means old and lithic means stone so uh, mainly they were herd hunters and herders and from hunters and herders they had uh, they has evolved themselves to a food producer okay so first they were hunters or food gatherers and, and gradually they develop into a food producing uh, people and at, from nomadic life to a settled life how they evolved from a uh, settled they began a settled life and also started a full-fledged cultivation in uh, the neolithic period and uh, and during that wills during that period wills and pottery has been evolved okay after that after that we have seen some uh, places from from uh, some prominent sites of that valley neolithic sites that uh, neolithic sites like uh, Suhan Valley, like uh, like Velan Valley, Chiran in Bihar, um, uh, Gafral, Verjohom, and uh, um, Mehargar. Okay, so these were the points. These were the overview of prehistoric uh, culture. So with this, we uh, we come to the end of today's video. So hope you all. Uh, enjoyed if you enjoyed please give thumbs up uh, so till then uh, thank you thank you for watching shining off jahind